Good morning, 530 on this uh, Monday. Uh, Missy O'Malley is off. Matt Elwell has our forecast in a moment. Meantime, our top story this morning, a former archbishop has called on the Pope to resign. Pope Francis also faced protest in Ireland this weekend as he attended the gathering of the Catholic Church. Andrew Spencer has our story. We ask for forgiveness. Hundreds of thousands of people gathered for mass in Dublin's Phoenix Park on Sunday. The Pope's visit coming amid a re-emerging international scandal of child sex abuse in the church and reports detailing decades of apparent cover-ups in the U.S., Chile, and Australia. We ask forgiveness for the times that, as a church, we did not show the survivors of whatever kind of abuse compassion. As the Pope addressed the scandal, he also faced a call for his resignation. In a statement seen by CNN on Sunday, former Archbishop and Vatican Ambassador to Washington, Carlo Maria Vagano, said he told the Pope in 2013 about allegations of sexual abuse against high-profile American Cardinal Theodore McCarrick. McCarrick resigned from his position last month after the report in Pennsylvania brought to light a decades-old allegation that he sexually abused a teenage altar boy. McCarrick said later in a statement that he had no recollection of it and that he believed himself innocent. Vigano wrote in a lengthy statement dated August 22nd that Pope Francis, quote, knew from at least June 23rd, 2013 that McCarrick was a serial predator and covered him to the bitter end. Speaking to reporters on the flight back to Italy, Pope Francis said Vigano's statement speaks for itself, that people should read it carefully and make their own judgment. The Pope telling the press, I will not say a single word on this, although he added that he may speak after some time passes. I'm Andrew Spencer reporting. Now in an unusually blunt letter released by the Vatican last week, Pope directly referred to the Pennsylvania report and acknowledged the Catholic Church's failure to act, adding, quote, we showed no care for the little ones, we abandoned them, end quote.